Rappers, did you uh, have like a relationship with uh, Kane Von? Yeah, you know that was my boy, man. What's up? Is that a rapper that you could say like he wasn't, you know, capping his rap, you know, bapping his uh, rap type shit? Bro, really in that shit. He a real nigga, man. I love the fuck out, bro. He in that shit for real, though. He one of the niggas from the rag that's really rapping what he living. So, you know, he had a, a video when he came back to the hood, gave out like 100,000, shit like that. Do you think like that's the type of things the rapper should do that came from a certain... Uh, I feel like any nigga that's, you know, see, Vaughn was a real nigga, though, folks, so I expected that shit from him, from him. And no, I already knew bro since like 14. I met bro at 14, 2014, as long as he got out. We click instant, you know. That's when I had the dreads and shit, me and bro, you know, that was my real homie and shit. But you know, bro, bro was a third nigga when I first met him for like, that's him from the beat. That's him for like, I be still fucked up, that shit happening, bro. What's up? You remember where you was at when you got the news? I was on my way coming from out of town. I'm driving, they told me, they, it wasn't back that he got killed. Yeah, it was just back like he was a critical, he got shot and shit. I'm get the fuck out of him. That shit fucked me up. I'm, I ain't think nothing of it because I'm thinking for the pool too and shit. I'm like, man, bro, I ain't gonna die. You know, once a motherfucker get hit up, and my man, I'm preparing for the, I'm, I'm hoping for the best, huh? And preparing for the worst, but I hope for the best first. I ain't gonna, oh, yeah, he can fuck around down. Man, bro, for the pool through that shit. I'm coming back from OT though, they they send me that shit, get the fuck out of here. Got two of them lame ass niggas. So do you remember like when you uh, first met Lil Herb? Uh, let me see. Yeah, I first met bro, I ain't, I was at the, we used to be hooping at the youth center and shit. Like I ain't really know him personally, I know him through like, other motherfucker, like motherfucker, like yeah, he some kin. Ooh, ooh, I'm here, you know. Then he hang. He, we all at this youth center, you know. Motherfuckers, we going out to school, getting on the computer. They feed us. This shit like out to school, shit like a little program. They feed us. We hooper playing basketball. Regular childhood shit. We did shit like that too. We went always on no block shit. That shit came later. But that's why I met him in though. I met him in the center and shit. Do you feel like them uh, centers and shit like that kind of kept motherfuckers out of the streets for a little minute? Yeah, that shit kept motherfuckers out of the streets. For a couple of hours. For a couple of hours. That shit like two, three hours. But then that shit followed us down. <laughs> you know, I can't speak on the rest of that shit, but I, like I said, with that one shit, that school shit motherfucker, that shit follow you there. And, and, at church, that shit'll follow you there. All the places you feel safe, that shit'll follow you. That shit'll follow you home in the street shit. You gotta prepare for all that shit. That shit'll follow you everywhere. 